applaud you, your majesty. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God, we thank you so much for your presence here. Thank you for sending Jesus, Emmanuel, to live in our hearts. Thank you for making your home in our hearts tonight, Lord. Hallelujah. We acknowledge your presence here tonight, Lord. We love you. We appreciate you. I wonder if, just before we close tonight, you want to just sit down for one second and rest? I want to make sure that we don't leave here without giving the Holy Spirit a chance to do what He does so well. Minister to those who are hurting and lost. And you may be here facing a situation that you feel there is no answer for. But I'm thankful tonight that we serve a God who specializes in the things that are impossible. <laughs> Aren't you thankful for that? That's the kind of stuff he loves. And you know what? You may be here with a financial need so great, you have, ha you have your back against the wall, and there's nothing more you can do. And that's a fearful and a wonderful place to be because you are utterly at the mercy of God. I don't know about the town you live in, but most towns, the banks are closed on Saturday night. And there's not a lot that you can do about your financial situation right now. But as we've spent these few moments worshiping Him, I know because God inhabits our praises that He can turn the hearts of kings on our behalf tonight. Nothing is too difficult for Him. You may be in the middle of a family situation that has brought you hurt and more hurt and loneliness. And I ask right now, in these moments, that the Lord would just move through this auditorium. Thousands of people here. Holy Spirit, I ask you to just pour your healing oil out on hurting situations. Hearts that are hurting, pour your oil of healing over that situation, God. Right now, make a way where there seems to be no way. Oh God, we know that you are working right now in ways that we can't see and how thankful we are for that. Hallelujah. We bless your name and we thank you, God, 